How can I help you today? Hi, I'm Lisa. My son's therapist said there is a possibility that he has autism. I'll be bringing him in, in a couple of days but I was just wondering what it is. I'll be glad to help. Autism is a developmental disability, which generally begins at birth or within the first three years of life. There are changes in the brain functions which causes delays or problems in different skills from infancy to adulthood. In fact research shows that 1 in 110 children all over the world have autism spectrum disorder and is more prevalent in boys than girls. I've heard that there are three different types. What exactly does that mean? Ah yes, it is a spectrum disorder which means different people with autism can have very different symptoms but similar features. There are three different types. They are autistic disorder, Asperger's disorder and pervasive development disorder which all three have different characteristics. So what exactly are the differences? Autistic disorder, also known as classic autism, generally have low levels of social interaction, limited interests and hobbies and these signs are generally seen at around the age of three. Oh, so do you think it's possible that my son has this? You can't really be sure until we do some tests. But there is also Asperger's disorder also known as Asperger's syndrome. They have difficulties with socializing but their cognitive and speech are not affected, although they do have limited hobbies as well but is detected later than classic autism. Pervasive development also known as atypical autism generally affects communication and has limited interests and repetitive behaviors. What? Will that mean for my little boy? How will he be affected? It is a bit hard to say anything and be absolutely certain until we have completed a checkup on him. However, some of the main factors include having poor language development, unusual or repetitive behaviors and there will be concerns about their social interaction. Is there a chance of him being cured? Unfortunately. There is no cure for autism as a whole. Although depending of the strength of difficulties your son is going through, sending him to a specialized school may be beneficial. Your son can also participate in behavioral training and management, and have specialized treatments such as speech, occupational and physical treatment, but most importantly he needs support from his parents and community. Also medication can be taken to reduce the symptoms of autism as a temporary cure. What kind of symptoms do you mean doctor? Well, doctors can prescribe medication to reduce aggression, self-injurious behaviors and severe tantrums. How did he get autism? To be completely honest, the cause of autism is not fully understood just yet. Although it is believed to be a neurological or genetic cause, or maybe even both. Neurologically the brain develops differently from typically developing children, and tends to grow too fast during early childhood, especially during the first three years old life. The brain of the infant appears to have more cells than it needs, as well as inefficient connections between the cells. Therefore there is no blood test, no scan and no image that can detect autism. Diagnosis relies on behavioral observation and screening. Anyways, thank you so much for your time doctor, I really appreciate it. I will bring him in next week. That's fine, no worries see you again. You made the right choice by coming to a doctor for a better understanding, once you get home you can also visit the EIOU Foundation website. Here are some interesting facts about autism spectrum disorder. Number 1. Autism is more common than childhood cancer, diabetes, and AIDS combined. Number 2. If one identical twin is diagnosed with autism, the other twin has about 90% chance of developing autistic disorder. Number 3. 
autism was initially called early infantile autism or Kanner's syndrome. Number four, from the Greek autos meaning self, autism literally means alone. Number five, scholars and parents debate whether autism is a disability or whether it should be considered merely a different kind of personality. What do you think? Hope you learned something. Bye.